The history of EcoInvent starts somewhere in the mid of the 90s, before I joined uh, EMPA. I think the nucleus behind it was the, that people realized that establishing a database is a lot of efforts, but maintaining a database is also a lot of efforts. And at the beginning, institutions in Switzerland, they were not speaking to each other. And so we had a different places, databases that started to be created. And so in the mid of 90s, these people started to speak together and said, hey, instead of having different databases, let's put all our data, pull them together into a single database. And then we have also a clear reference that we can use in order to do LCA studies here in, in, in Switzerland. What makes me proud within the whole activities of EcoInvent is in, in a way is the result that, that, that we have, that we succeeded within a couple of years really to create this single database here in, in, in Switzerland. And one important point that was very good from the very beginning on was to say, we stick to, to a database. We, we only do the database, we fix a format for the data, and we don't say which tool you have to use. We, we need to find ways how LCA gets less complicated for people to apply it in order that more people that take decisions somewhere in industry can apply LCA. So we need simplified approaches, simplified tools in order that a non-specialist can apply LCA. If, if we look into the future, I think EcoInvent has a very can have a very strong position due to the structure of its data. EcoInvent always uh, paid a lot of attention to have a high transparency in, in its data. And with the regulations, directives that are popping up at the moment, this issue of transparency will get more and more important for companies. Also in, in the reporting that they will be obliged to, to do in, in the future. So for companies it, it will be very important that they can have access to, to transparent data when they report about their sustainability issues. And there I think EcoInvent is in a, is a very good position in order to, to, to fulfill these requirements. I think one of the things that make me most proud of is how EcoInvent evolved. This database, when I first heard about this database from my supervisor, I thought, hey, that's really genius, this idea, but that will never work. And since 2003, this database is accessible online and you have more and more people that use this database. 